The ocean depths are a realm of mystery. They are also a place of immense power. Hidden beneath the waves lie mountains, some taller than Everest. These seamounts, formed by volcanic activity, pose a significant threat to submarines. The Indo-Pacific region, a hotbed of geopolitical activity, is home to a complex network of these underwater mountains. The U.S. Navy, with its powerful submarine fleet, faces constant danger in these waters. Seamounts, shrouded in darkness, can rise from the ocean floor with little warning. A collision, even at low speeds, can be catastrophic. The USS San Francisco incident in 2005 stands as a stark reminder of these dangers. The USS San Francisco, a nuclear-powered submarine, was on a routine patrol, its mission to maintain peace and security in the vast Pacific. But the ocean held a hidden danger, an uncharted seamount lay directly in its path. The collision was unavoidable. The submarine traveling at high speed slammed into the underwater mountain. The impact sent shockwaves through the vessel injuring dozens of crew members. The submarine severely damaged limped back to port. This incident served as a wake-up call. It exposed the limitations of undersea navigation and the need for better mapping of the ocean floor. The U.S. Navy, determined to prevent such accidents, invested heavily in new technologies and training programs. Submarines rely on sonar to navigate the ocean depths. Sound waves bouncing off objects create an image of the underwater world. But sonar has its limitations. It can be unreliable, especially in areas with complex underwater terrain. The USS San Francisco incident highlighted these limitations. The submarine's sonar failed to detect the seamount in time. The reasons for this failure were complex. Factors such as water conditions and the seamount's composition likely played a role. This incident spurred a technological revolution in undersea navigation. The Navy invested in advanced sonar systems, capable of producing higher resolution images. They also developed new algorithms to better interpret sonar data. Section 4. Navigating the Uncharted, Mapping the Deep Despite technological advancements, much of the ocean floor remains unmapped. This lack of knowledge poses a constant threat to submarines. The challenge is immense. The ocean is vast and mapping its depths is a time-consuming and expensive endeavor. Traditional methods, such as using sonar from surface ships, are slow and inefficient. New technologies such as autonomous underwater vehicles or AUVs offer a promising solution. These robotic explorers can map the ocean floor with greater speed and accuracy. The U.S. Navy is at the forefront of this mapping revolution. They are deploying fleets of AUVs to chart the ocean depths. These efforts are critical for ensuring the safety of submarines and advancing our understanding of the ocean. Section 5. Training for the Abyss, Preparing for the Unknown Technology alone is not enough to ensure submarine safety. Equally important is the training of the crew. Submariners must be prepared to navigate the ocean's hidden dangers. This training is rigorous and demanding. Crews spend countless hours in simulators, honing their skills in a virtual underwater world. They learn to interpret sonar data, identify potential hazards, and react quickly in emergencies. The goal is to create a culture of safety, where every crew member is vigilant and prepared. The lessons learned from the USS San Francisco incident are deeply ingrained in these training programs. Today's submariners are better equipped than ever to face the challenges of the deep. Their mission is vital and their training reflects the importance of their task.